What type of ice cream do I want? Mmm, ice cream. I gotta try them all. All of them? Okay, so do I want water ice cream? Grass ice cream. Yes, yes. Lucky lime. Here you go, Pot Pot. Uh, ah. Cute. Okay, so we, we don't need to waste time getting all sorts Here, of ice Pat. cream. So I have to wonder who this random dog is. It's a cool dog. I think that puppy wants to play with you, Pep. It's a puppy. Off you go to play with your friend. Oh, but I, I, I was actually going to leave. I I'm gonna immediately grab Pep back. Oh, I'm such a jerk. Here, Pep! That dog has long ears. It's just so cute. Okay, um, yes, yes, yes. Okay, so we've we've got things to do. Let's actually get Pep a dog tag. Yeah, seeing as we're, we're in the middle of just getting rid of Pep, being a jerk, let's do that again. Let's do that again. Get rid of Pep in the ball pit and use the dog tag machine. Hey, Mr. Kibble, I see you finished putting that machine together. And a very good job I did of it, too. How would you like to be the first one to make a dog tag with it? Would I? I sure would. Be my guest. Okay, says here to just push the buttons at the bottom to choose the shape and color you want for your new tag. And if I want to put Pep's name on it? Hmm. If you would like your tag engraved, push the text button, then type your inscription. That's all there is to it? Yup. And once you're all done, pull the big red lever and the machine will take care of the rest. Sounds good. Pep is Okay, I had to pull the lever twice. Yay! I made a shiny new tag! I can put it on the collar if you'd like. Yes, please! All set! Pep is gonna love it. It does not say Pep at all. Thanks a bunch! This bag is where it's I put the horrible. items I need to get for Pep's party. I'm so happy I still the game need that. a cake and confirmation from a magician. All right, we can get magician confirmation. Hey, Pep, want to go for a ride? We basically solved the magician puzzle already. We've, we've got the magician's hat now. We just need to get the hat to the magician. And I don't think I visited the cake area yet. I'm ashamed. I will. I will do that after after the magician. Marvin, is this your magic hat? There's only one way to find out. Abracadabra, abracadiddle, abracadoodle. You did it! Great trick, Marvin. I am gloriously grateful for your help, Putt Putt. Wherever did you find my hat? Your hat had been mixed up with Ms. Bundle Nuggets. Ah, our friendly local librarian, keeper of the books. I shall now return the other hat to her. Biblio, Bablio, boom! Whoa. Let's watch the journey of the hat. Now wow. that you have the right hat, will you be ready to put on a big show tomorrow? Of course. Expect me to appear at the party. Here's my card. On the back, there's a coupon for 20% off dry cleaning. Wow! 20% off dry cleaning? But... I don't wear clothes. This is I'm the special car. bag Mrs. Widget gave me to Why store all I of the items I need for Pep's party. All I need now is a birthday cake. Well, 
Why, why do I need dry cleaning? Oh my gosh, this guy knows real magic. He just made a hat teleport halfway across town. That's pretty amazing. Your hat seems to be working really well. You have earned my eternal gratitude, Putt-Putt. And he can spy on people whenever he wants. That's that's kind of creepy, actually, but it's magical. And uh, these people are Coco people, I believe. Wowie zowie! Not one, but two Caristas? I guess that means no Caristas. waiting in line for Coco anymore. Is that Coco you're selling there? Well, hello there, young sir. Why, yes, but it's not just any Coco. Car Town's best, there's nothing sweeter, more fun than a totter teeter. Car Town's best, there's nothing hotter, what I meant was teeter totter. Here, why, you really should have a taste. Whoa, whoa. That whoa. cocoa is very good. Thank you. Okay, so we have some addictive cocoa. Are you selling cocoa as well? As well? Why, you bet we're selling cocoa, but not just any cocoa. Always creamy, always hot. Carbucks cocoa hits the spot. If it's rainy, if it's not, Carbucks cocoa. Here, you can judge for yourself. I love how whenever you get cocoa, the cart you're not getting cocoa from looks offended. Mmm, like, that's good How could you cheat cocoa. on me with the other type Thank of cocoa? You. How, how could you? How could you, putt putt? <laughs> okay. So let's meet the, the chef. Hello, Mrs. Goodbake. Hello, putt putt. I need to ask you a question about a cake. For a special occasion. I think we should talk about this in private, by ourselves. Okay, go away, Pep. Hey, Pep, could you do me a big favor and go get me some cocoa? <coughs> ah, now we can talk privately. I understand you're planning a party for Pep. Yes. <laughs> It's going to be a surprise party tomorrow. I'm sure it will be a great party, and I'll be there. I need a cake for the party. You came to the right place. I can make very special party cakes for anyone, even puppies. And you can even help me decorate it. The only problem is that I'm out of two important ingredients. I need sugar. And milk. Okay. Couldn't you just make a cake without them? No. Heavens no. Without those, it'd be more like a brick. If you bring me those ingredients, I'll make the cake and you can decorate it. Thank you, Pep. You're a good boy. What a great dog giving me free cocoa. That's a great dog. That's a good dog right there. Thanks, Pat Pat. See you soon. Alrighty, so in order to get the sugar, we just have to go here and get sugar. So use the sugar on the sugar. Mind if I fill my sack with sugar? Be my guest. I'll just put it on Mrs. Goodbake's tab. Nice. I don't even have to pay for it. Mmm. Sugar. Oh, yeah. Sugar, give me the sugar. That's the good stuff. Oh, man. Reminds me of the time I was babysitting and uh, the, the kids uh, opened up the kitchen cabinet and went straight for frosting, cake frosting, and just ate the frosting. That's what they wanted for dinner. They figured they could get away for it, get away with it, because they had a babysitter and their parents weren't around. So they just ran straight to the, <laughs> to the cabinet and just ate 
frosting. They didn't, they didn't have it on cake. They just ate plain frosting. Okay. <laughs> That's kind of gross. Anyway, I'm, I I think that sometimes uh, you're supposed to get flour, and if you have to get flour, you obviously use the sack on flour instead of on on the sugar. 